Say you don't treat her good Say you know me I take it she the good good Say you don't treat her right Hi guys, it's Maya and welcome back to my channel. If you are new, welcome cousin, how are you? Here on my channel, I do whatever I want. So welcome to a hair video. I will be showing you guys how I easily, easily fix over bleached knots. And I will also be showing you guys the install process of this hair. So if that's something that you guys will be interested in, then go ahead and keep on watching. so you guys um i bleached the knots and you see the knots are in fact bleached however i must have made it too thin because it actually seeps through the lace into and onto the hair so there's an easy way to fix this and i'll be showing you guys how to do that throughout this video but i'm just showing you guys because i want you guys to remember what it looks like now the hair is bleached it is brown and when you part it it's going to look like it's bald so we are going to fix this Aside from the fact that I did over bleach it, I still want to show you guys the hairline and everything. Um, this is the this is how the wig looks on the inside. I'm, I love the parting space. It has the combs and the straps in the back. So you guys see when it's on, this looks this looks terrible. I would not go outside like this, and I would not want you guys going outside like this either. So to easily fix this, all you need is a sharpie marker. So what we're going to do is take our marker and just put it on wherever the bleach went into. Um, you can use parts and stuff like that, but yeah, so you literally just want to color on the hair. Try not to get this on the lace, um, just go as close to the hair follicles as you can and boom. So this is definitely an improvement. It does dry very fast as well. You can actually go in between the hairs if you'd like. Um, I did it just to show you guys um, some more. But you could just leave it on the part that you want to have it on and you'll be fine. So now we're just going to install the wig. So now that we've cut the ear pieces and cut the lace, I'm going to take some hair from the very front of the hairline and I'm going to use this as my grip and my guard. This will help me lay my wig better and more precise. So I will be installing my wig using Ghost Bond Glue. This is about $22 to $21 at the beauty supply store. You want to apply a layer, smooth it out, wait until clear and then put the lace back on.
if you guys are interested in this pretty pink hot comb, the link will be in the description box. I am in love with it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to put your post notifications on so that you never miss an upload. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. My Instagram is down below. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.